Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is your girl Jasmine, and today is going to be a controversial video. It's actually not controversial, I just have to say it is because of the fact that everyone who makes a video towards another big YouTuber has to say it's controversial. In my opinion, it's just my motherfucking opinion. But, because I am on the internet, I have to be cautious of what I say and what I do, so I always have to put in little... Little captions for those that don't understand life. The video today is going to be about a YouTuber that I've been following forever named Pink Sparkles. I'm putting this disclaimer out right now because of the fact that I know herself, her viewers, or someone is going to watch this video and not watch the entire thing and comment some bullshit thing without knowing what I'm saying. But disclaimer, I do not hate her. I have no hate towards her. This isn't even a hate video. This is If you're going to expect like a 10 minute video of me hating on someone, that's not going to really happen. But this is a video that has to be made because of the fact that I've been subscribed to this woman for about a mm, really long time. Since she's had like 5,000 subscribers. And she has like, I heard she has like 900k subscribers. I haven't looked in a while. Then known about this woman for a long time and supporting her. Why? Because she used to make really great content. She is super funny. She is herself. She's a very positive person. My thing is, is she has changed. Now, when I say the word change, people are going to come at me and be like, everyone changes. Were you the same person five years ago? No, I wasn't, but I don't mean she changed as in she got older and her personality developed. I'm talking about how she changed as in the way she acts. I feel like her energy in her old videos, like, were more, like, out there. Like, she, not that she doesn't want to do videos now, it's just I feel like her ideas now aren't the greatest. And I know being on YouTube for, like, five years, you're going to run out of ideas. I understand the pain of coming up with content because I can't come up with shit. I just feel like I've been feeling some fake vibes and I can't say anything about her plastic surgery because my opinions don't matter. I don't care what you do with your body. I don't care that she has fake boobs or that she went and got a fake butt or that she got liposuction or I don't give a fuck about any of that. I really do not care. Well, I would get that for myself. Doesn't mean I don't care what other people do with their body. So I have nothing against her and what she chooses to do with her body. It's just I feel like she's just not herself. I feel like she's... It's okay to have a role model. And I know her role model is Kylie Jenner. And it's totally fine to look up to your role model and use them as inspiration for things like fashion and stuff. But I feel like she's going so hard with this Kylie Jenner stuff. It's not even funny. Like... She had the fake boobs before following Kylie Jenner, so she got the fake butt, she got her waist tightened, and on top of that, she got, like, the long colored weave, and then she started buying Kylie's pre-owned dresses, and like I said, I don't care what you do and what who you follow as a role model, but, like, honestly, the fact that your personality is changing with that, like, no one wants to see that, like, no one cares to see you act like that, like, it. if you go on any form, as of right now, no one is liking the way you're acting right now. Because of the fact that you're acting fake, and you're being scammy. No, hey, I don't think Pink Sparkles is an evil person. I don't think she's a scammer who's gonna fucking take your money. A bad person. Like, this whole video is not her about being an evil person. I think she's still genuine. It's just like, I don't know. It's just really hard to connect to a YouTuber once you find out they're liars. I have so many mixed emotions, like, she's not owning up, and I've seen so many video clips proving that, like, she'll own up to something, but then she'll, like, play victim card. And girl, I, I understand swallowing pride. I understand how hard it is to swallow your pride and apologize full on. I know how hard it is, but you have to do it. And you especially have to do it because of the fact that you have 900k subscribers. I... I have like 35 subscribers and I would full on apologize because of the fact that like it doesn't matter how many subscribers you have, they all matter. Like I only have 35 subscribers, but they all matter to me and I wouldn't lie to the people that watch me because thank fucking god they're watching me. Not to mention, like, you're getting paid for your videos. You're getting paid for videos. You are getting paid to advertise products. And yet, you're still scamming people. Like, like, 
It just look, makes you look like a money greeter. I was gonna get a lot of hate, but you know what? I don't give a fuck because I am brutally honest. You have to give me credit. I am not lying about anything. Everything I've said in this video has not been made up about pink sparkles. It's legit just true. It's like, girl, I love you so much and I wish you could come out and be how you used to be and just fucking apologize. You lie about the littlest things. That's that's why I don't hate her lies. It's about the stupidest shit. Don't get me wrong, the scam was a huge lie. Like, bad lie. I'm not excusing that. But I'm just saying, like, she's not lying about big things, so, like, I'm gonna give her some credit. But why do you have to lie about small stuff? If you're going to lie, lie, lie better. If you're gonna use that tactic in your videos and, like, all your things, you should probably learn to lie better. Girl, if you're gonna be making that paper, you better be a good hustler. I'm just saying. You gotta hustle if you're gonna be on that route. The reason I'm putting my input in, because people are like, oh, you're just putting your input in to get views. True. I'm not gonna lie about that. That is kind of true. But at the same time, I am a fellow viewer. I have every right to make a video. And I feel like the more videos she sees of people not happy with her, the more she'll probably think about not lying again still subscribe by the way like I said before this is no hate I have to disclaim every five minutes because someone's gonna be like well you say you're not hating but it sounds like you're hating girl it's me being truthful like I'm a Virgo I am brutally fucking honest and I analyze people by the way pink sparkles your hair looks gorgeous like a whole video of just like not really positive things towards pink sparkles and then I go off and say, oh, but you have nice hair. <laughs> I'm such a jackass. Sparkles, if you're watching this, just know I'm still subscribed to you, I still support you, and I don't think you're an evil person like some people are saying you are, because that's a little, it's a little far to say. But please, stop lying. Give people their refunds. Like, if you're gonna do some shady shit, you better be really good in your shady shit, because, um, that's how you get caught. See, and I'm not sitting here acting like I'm a perfect person, but the thing is, if I'm going to be shady, I'm going to be really fucking good at being shady. You feel what I'm saying? And the only time I'm shady is never. See what I, see what I did? I'm a shady bitch. Shady bitch.